Hey, no group I'd rather go to war with than the ones right here, man. Love y'all. Win on three, one, two, three. Win. Tonight looms large for the Bills and their fans. A win for the advance Buffalo from contender to the top dog in the AFC. Playback is on three. Playback is on three. One, two, three. Playback. A win would exercise the demons from two tough losses to Kansas City last year. A win tonight on national TV would put the Bills in the driver's seat as the team to beat. Josh going to keep it himself and run it again inside the five into the end zone. Touchdown, Buffalo! To start off the game like that, that is a confidence builder for this team, for this offense. Emmanuel Sanders. After I caught it, I didn't even know what to do because I just kept thinking like, yo, that throw was crazy. That throw was a rocket. Like literally, he just put it there and it just stuck in my hand. It was like, what the heck? 14 to 10, the Bills regain the lead. Third and two, and getting stuffed. Keep going, just keep focusing, focus, focus. The Buffalo Bills, to me, from the beginning of this game, seems like they've had a plan, they have stuck to that plan, and it's working. Deep downfield, getting free is Diggs. For a gain of 61. Josh gets it, looks, looks, gets away from pressure, rolls to the right sideline, fires it downfield, got a man wide open, caught. Dawson Knox makes the catch at the 15, cruises into the end zone, touchdown, Buffalo! I mean, he's on the run, I'm sure it was 50 yards, just on a dot, like it was a perfect throw. I was just, the whole time it's in the air, I'm just like, gotta catch it, gotta catch it, gotta catch it. <laughs> Halftime in Kansas City, Bills lead the Chiefs 24 to 13. And that wind is picking up, and I'm looking at the radar, and it looks like some rain's coming in quickly. It looks like 10.30 Eastern time would be the earliest we can restart, so it will be a while here with a delay. They are eating sandwiches, although a couple have complained to me that there's too much peanut butter on the sandwiches. It's like 70-30 with the jelly, so they're not enjoying those as much. They did say the oranges in the locker room were, and I'm quoting, fire. And we are, after a one hour and 14 minute delay, ready for action. Mahomes steps up, fires the pass, off the hands, intercepted by Micah Hyde at the 10, at the 5, touchdown Buffalo! Micah Hyde got the tip pass and cruised into the end zone for the Buffalo touchdown. We knew once the rain starts coming, those tip balls and stuff, you know, they happen, so I was able to tip it up and get this thing going. for the Kansas City Chiefs, and a dream for the Buffalo Bills. This would be a monster conversion if they could pick it up. They rule it incomplete. And so the Bills go three and out. The rain begins to come down again, but the Chiefs are back in the game. Little shovel pass from Patrick Mahomes to Travis Kelsey for the Chiefs touchdown. The Buffalo lead is now 31-20. Josh Allen, if they bring something crazy, always an option to run. Now they come. Here goes Allen. He hurdles and picks up the first down. He jumped right over Sneed. What a play by Josh Allen. Sometimes there are just those plays that make that season-ending highlight reel, and that is going to be one of them. I'll take that first down. He can jump over me if he wants for that first down. <laughs> Second down and six. Off the fake. Throws. Touchdown. Emmanuel Sanders with his second touchdown of the game. And Buffalo's almost put it out of reach. That's that too That's what they said. 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 In the waning minutes here in Kansas City's Arrowhead Stadium. Drops it. Mahomes goes back to pick it up. He still hasn't picked it up. It's a loose ball at the 30-yard line. They're scrambling for it. Bodies flying all over the place. And I think Tredavious White may have come up with it. It is Buffalo ball. That'll put the icing on this cake. 
The Bills come up with the football. They're coming up with a big win in Kansas City tonight. When we get to the end of this football season, we're going to look back on this night, and we're going to say this is the night a lot of things changed in the AFC.